So this is how you prepare your iPad before you sell it, give it away, or trade it in. The first thing I like to do is remove any screen protectors and remove any cases that the iPad would be in. I'm gonna remove a physical SIM card, which a lot of you probably won't have to do this step because you have an eSIM. But for now, I'm just gonna show you how to remove the SIM card, and it's recommended that I power this off to do so. So with this little gadget, all you gotta do is put it in this hole to the SIM card slot, press it down, and that'll pop the tray up. Then you can just pull that out of there and remove the SIM card. The next thing you wanna do is back up your iPad to iCloud. So go ahead and select settings there, select your name, select iCloud, and then iCloud backup. And then what you wanna do is select backup now. Give it a moment and let it back up. Now it will prompt you to back up during the erase process as well. The next thing we wanna do is select your name and we wanna come down here and we wanna sign out of iCloud. So we're gonna start this by going ahead and signing out. So it gives us the option right here to erase this iPad after signing out. So I'm gonna go ahead and start the process right from this screen. Now in this screen right here is where you guys might see something different. You might have in yours down here, it might say e eSIM. I just want to share with you that same exact screen on the iPad Pro 13 inch M5. You can see where it says eSIM right there. It explains in here, if you click on that, that it'll give you the option of keeping the eSIM in the cellular plan or erasing it during the erase process. This does not have that because I do not have a cellular plan on this one. I'm going to go ahead and click continue and erase iPad and it's trying to do another backup as I told you guys it would, which is kind of a nice feature, but we don't need to do that. So I'm gonna to choose to skip the backup because I already did it. Now this is actually really nice too. It's going to turn off Find My and Activation Lock. So I'm all ready to go here to turn off Find My and Activation Lock, and this will sign me out of iCloud, and it's gonna erase this iPad, and it's gonna erase the eSIM if you have eSIM on yours. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose to turn off. So it looks like it's shutting down and deleting everything. So the very last thing to do is check another device, go on your Mac, your computer, another mobile device, and go into your settings, go to your iCloud account, and make sure that your device, the one that you're trading in or selling, no longer shows up in this list down here. Mine was in the list, now it is gone, so it has been officially removed. If you go through this whole process and your device is still showing up, you wanna tap on it and you wanna remove it from your account. Okay, so that should be it, it should be all ready to go. The only other thing I would mention is maybe if you had an Apple Care Plan or Apple One, and you might be able to hand that off to a family member or something like that through your account. That's all I had for you guys. I hope the video was helpful and if it was hit the like button and I will see you guys in the next one.